Hey, everyone, and welcome to the Horror Hour. I'm one of your hosts, Yutaka. Uh, my other two co-hosts could not be joining because, unfortunately, they don't have access to Slasher overseas with Shudder. So, Shudder, let's get on that. So, I'm here to review Slasher Flesh and Blood. Um, it's a Shudder exclusive, and I'm going to give you some reasons why you should watch it. I'm going to do my best not to spoil anything because I really think you should go in just blind all right everyone so i'm going to give you some reasons why you should be watching shutters slasher flesh and blood so first off we got a great cast i mean they really go all in on this there's some high camp value i mean there's definitely some characters you are going to hate and you're not going to be upset if they go all right you also got a hot cast some of these are really good looking people. Just saying, that's always nice. They respect pronouns, and that's important. And Shudder actually does foster a lot of that. So that's awesome, Shudder. And then you've got, well, you've got those crazy traps. And I just love that. It's not like Saw like. This is actually something to where these families have to complete a task and then be the first one to get it. So then they can continue to move on within the comp competition. Whereas if you don't, you could get offed. Meanwhile, while they're going through all of this, you also then have an amazing, which I do love that mask killer stalking them and that's the gentleman and so while they're there while they're on this isolated island in this huge mansion doing all these tasks you've got another individual out there taking out the competition one by one and it all builds up to a crazy final conclusion where the killer is unmasked and then we will see who's the last one standing i really enjoy it uh it also one of the big highlights it includes David Cronenberg, the legendary David Cronenberg, you know, from su directing such things as The Fly, Shivers, Videodrome. So he's known also for having movies with really good practical effects. And they spare no expense here in that factor. There is a lot of that um, when it comes to some gore and some blood. Again, Shudder spared no expense on this season, and it shows. It's so good. It's so polished. It's a lot of fun. It's got camp. It's funny. It's got good death scenes. And it's got an ending that I think will blow you away. All the episodes of Slasher, Flesh, and Blood are now available on Shudder. So if you subscribe to Shudder, go watch them, go binge them. If you don't, what are you waiting for? Come on. You're not going to do a series like this on any of the streaming channels. This is an actual horror series, gory horror series. And it's so much fun. It's so great. I really love it. If I were to go on to Slasher's website, which I will do, I would give this a five out of five because I really had a great time. I really enjoyed it. I mean, for the most part, and I think that's what they were going for in terms of the family. You're not going to be upset about most of them, but they actually do have, I would say, maybe two innocent victims to where you're just, oh, you really were wishing it wasn't them. But that's okay. That's part of the whole series. So again, Slasher, Flesh and Blood, it's a Shutter exclusive. All eight episodes air or are now available to be binged. Go do that. I highly recommend it. And um, again, I apologize that my co-host could not be here, but this is not available in their area. So hopefully we get to see some reviews from them as well, from things that may be in their area that I don't have access to yet, because I think Shutter does offer some incredible content um, worldwide. And so it'd be really unique to see what other offerings they're giving us. And let's not forget, though, Liam and I, he's a council co-host. We're going to be doing recaps of season four Boulay Brothers, Dracula.
So that's my quick review of Slasher Flesh and Blood. Go watch it. All eight episodes are available now. It's on Shutter. It's a really great time. I promise you, you will not be upset. And if you are watching it, comment down below who you thought was the killer. Of course, put spoiler. Um, and if you're not watching it, do you even like horror? All right. So as everything, thank you for watching the Horror Hour. My name is Yutaka. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Bye. You have been listening to the Horror Hour. See you next time.